just think a little bit too much right, I think, there from the last shade. Former world number one and current world number one in the Longines world rankings for Switzerland, Steve Gerdat with the 11 year old gelding Alamo. And Steve, victorious in 2015 on Alfred's Pale, followed that up in 2016 with Corbinian and bidding to win his third World Cup final. Steve Gerdat, world number one. Alamo. So I'm jumping last in Paris and was jumping a beautiful double clear in the in the Grand Prix. And he was really happy with him then, so shot on that one. Ooh. Oh. See the last line now. He needs to um, be at the plank. I think, yeah. 50 seconds. Yeah. He's got a bit of work to do, but it's going to be very Ooh. close indeed. Goes through the double, him? still clear. 61.31. He's got to fly the last. He does. Oh. He stops the clock in 61.28. Steve Gerdan goes into the lead here on day one in Gothenburg of the 2019 World Cup final. Steve Gerdan stops the clock in 61.28 seconds on the 11 year old Alamo. The world number one goes into to the lead with two riders to come. It's Let's have a look a at this. Uh, Marlon, we're going to be, we're just going to be shown um, Steve Gerdat and Peter Davos. Six, yeah. Let's just remind ourselves. Steve on the left, 61.28, and Peter on the right, 61.31. Yeah, three hundredths of a second. You see here, Peter is quite a bit ahead of Steve. I think. Steve is catching up a bit. And this difficult turn to get a good stride. They're both perfect on that, spot on. Yeah, it's very close. And I think just Steve got here. Exactly. Yeah. A really forward one to that plank. Just on the same here. Yeah. And you can't really see it. Three hundredths of a second, of a you second. Can't, as, not as to be as seen. You say, 